Hello, today I'm going to show you some of the new uh, features of Clara Detail Plus uh, Thickness Operator. I'm going to uh, work on this model in this example. Um, if you go to the tools when your object is selected, uh, you can see all the operators that can be applied on it and they all coming with new icons so you can adjust the size and when you release uh, your mouse you're going to uh, have more icons as you uh, wish so you can make it in one column and all of them are uh, easier to access so based on your preference you can adjust this you can go to the face mode I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna go to the face mode you can select the face you can go to the edge mode you have a new series of icon the same way as your edges and the same way in the vertex mode okay I'm gonna um, go to the object mode so in the tools as you can see here your material is one-sided. You can uh, first select your mesh, go to the material, and click on this arrow so you have access to your material. By default, double-sided material is off, so you can make it on and then see what's going on. I'm just going to make turn it off so I can see uh, what really is my uh, real faces, which is this side. I'm going to make a new series of faces by using thickness operator. I'm going to select this. I'm going to go to thickness. Then uh, we're going to apply uh, a new uh, series of edges on the other side, which wasn't visible uh, by default. So uh, I'm going to go to the length in the thickness. You can change it and add more thickness to, to your mesh. Uh, just to let you see better, I, I'm going to select this cylinder. I applied. I remove this cap uh, from the cylinder and you can see it's one sided like this. So I'm going to apply this thickness operator, which is again from here. Uh, let me remove the current one. I'm going to apply this thickness and then you can resize this. And then you have uh, these segments here, which allows you to select. Uh, another feature that uh, people were requesting, if you right click on one of these uh, arrows here, you're going to reset everything to the default. So I'm going to reset everything by clicking on this. I can change this. Uh, I can make this length and then right click, right click uh, here on these arrows. It's going to reset it to the default. So that's for this week. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, thank you for subscribing. Comment below. See you later.